telling African stories at a world-class level. That's the goal for tech entrepreneur turned film director Editi F. Young. He's filming the final scenes of his movie, Black Book. Editi raised $1 million from a small circle of friends to make his film. It's the highest amount any Nollywood filmmaker has ever raised. Uh, it's important that we improve investments in filmmaking and um, I guess being, a, being from the tech industry, access to funding was something that it, 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 made, it gave us access and opportunity to secure the funding for the project. For years, Nollywood filmmakers have struggled to get funding and ultimately make money off their work. The major problem? Piracy. But these days, things are starting to change. Piracy in the country still exists, but an increasing number of investors are betting on film production to catch the eye of a larger global audience. Nigerian filmmakers feel they have finally unlocked a profitable business model, international streaming platforms. Lala Akindoju is the producer of this film. She has produced many films for global streaming platforms like Netflix. She says these platforms are helping filmmakers profit from their passion. It's like the world is right there, seeing it at the same time, and the filmmakers still get to make the money. International movie industry players are increasing their demand for African content. In 2019, French TV company Canal Plus acquired Nigerian production company Rock Studios, one of the largest film producers on the continent. The studio produces around 300 films and 20 TV series annually. Netflix has spent hundreds of thousands of dollars to make films and series with African filmmakers. Now, the African filmmakers are ready to put in the work, you know, the production values, the attention to detail, the, the, the scale for global filmmaking and, and storytelling for our own stories. So you, the world hasn't even seen anything yet because there are many more stories coming up. Director Editi F. Young plans to put his film on Netflix when it's ready. For him, doing what he loves at a global scale is a dream come true.